and welcome to the Oracle Shop, your spiritual shopping channel. Here today I have Molly Unfairly. Hello. Hi. And you've brought with, with you uh, Psychic Slimming. I have indeed, yes. And I've never heard of Psychic Slimming before. Perhaps you can tell me a little bit about it. Uh, well, the first thing I would tell you, Jade, is not, not many people have heard about Psychic Slimming. And it is fascinating because the way it works is um, I'm very psychic and I've written this whole program for ladies and um, they ask a question of why they would have a problem okay. with their weight. Mm -hmm. And I've got in front of you here today cards that will give them the answers and a book that will use, use to heal them. Um, the purple cards are the ladies channel challenge. So whatever your weight problem is, those of you who have a weight problem, when you're shuffling the cards I'd ask you to choose the purple card and then we will find out fairly quickly what the root of the problem is. Shuffle the cards and I want you to look for your particular challenge. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now you're seeing my shuffling skills. That's all right, we don't worry about that. <laughs> there's, lots of, there's lots of these cards because there's a lot of reasons why a woman would have a weight problem. Okay, so I need to choose one of these. Yeah. From anywhere in the pack. Anywhere in the pack. And then you read that. <laughs> so I've got, you can't be bothered. So, is that true? You can't be bothered to do anything about your weight? Yes, it's very true. Yes, mm. yes. Does that surprise you that card to come up? Um, no, it doesn't it's a bit actually. In your face, isn't it? Yes, it's a bit yeah, in your face. yes. Yeah, people do say to me, these cards are a bit in your face. They don't bother about them. So what you would do now is, you now establish that, and you need to realise that you've got that message from spirit. Right. Yeah, they know. So you can't fob it off. Okay. And you need now to look in there. That card's got a number on it. So what we're looking here for, these are these cards here, the pink cards. These are your solution cards. Okay. So and these are going to give you the answer. You need to find number 15. Yeah. So I've got number 15 there. Yeah. So yeah. If I put that just down there for a yeah. moment and find number 15 in here. So what does that say? It says renewed interest in yourself. Yeah. So that it signifies that you need to renew interest in yourself and your body and how you are, doesn't it? Yes. Yeah. So what you now need to do is you need to look up in this book. I've got a special little book with pretty pages here. Oh, wonderful. Yeah, I've got two in there anyway. You need to look up number 15 and read what it says about you can't be bothered. Okay, so we've <coughs> got here number 15, you can't be bothered. You want to lose weight, but you don't stick to a serious weight loss campaign. Why not? It is, too, is it too much of an effort? It might feel easier to stay fat. Perhaps you just don't believe that you are determined enough to shift that weight. The moment of power is now. Stop dithering. Commit to changing yourself and your body. Decide you can do this. Well, those are... Those are powerful good words, words for me. <laughs> yeah, and you, you don't do anything else until you've absorbed those words. Okay. <clears throat> and acknowledge the fact that maybe you haven't been bothering, maybe you've let things slide, and now you've been given a definite message. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> so you tell me when you've absorbed those words. Okay, yes, I, th I, think, I, I think I already have. I you've think got I that. Yes, yes. So then what you do next is you place that pink one on top of the purple card. Okay. So I put the pink card on top of the purple. Yeah. And now I'd like you to think about putting these two cards somewhere very special. Okay. With reverence. It's a ritual. So for the purpose of uh, just doing it now, then I'll just place it over here. Yeah. Okay. And how long does it have to stay there? You're going to leave those cards to fuse with each other for mm -hmm. 24 hours. Okay. Okay. Now, in the meantime, you can have a look and see what is going to happen. Number 15 in the solution pink page. So, number 15, solution pink page, is renewed interest in yourself. Dana is a powerful Celtic creator goddess who emanates wisdom. Dana works with wavelengths of energy of which you are a part. Dana reminds you that you are also a goddess in the making. Wear, look at or hold something that makes you feel good about yourself. Imagine yourself certain of losing the weight. Mentally say to Dana, thank you for helping me to slim. 
Please make my body the way I want it to be. Thank you for helping me with any guilt I have. Thank you for filling my heart with the certainty that I can become the woman I really want to be. What reassuring words. Mm. And, and it's powerful. quite quite spiritual words, so you can Very. tell they're not our kind of words, are they? They're coming no. from somewhere else. Mm. So you would then keep renewing your vow, because you're doing a ritual here. Mm -hmm. I'm interested in losing weight. I'm interested in renewing my energy towards this. I'm interested in getting myself back on, on target. Yeah. Okay. Just look at the card the num um, the, the words on the pink card and keep on repeating them during those twenty four hours. And then at the end of twenty four hours, we skip twenty four hours now. We, so, okay. So let's say twenty four hours yeah, have passed. And you place those cards, that's it. Okay. If the mauve one is next to the pink, the pink mm -hmm. is going to really, really shoot energy through and completely heal it and you close that book and then you would place that book again back in your special place okay and how long does it stay there for as long as it takes for it to work so right. each lady is going to be completely unique one lady it might take half a day somebody else it might take two weeks what will happen what should happen is that you will lose interest in things that were making you be um, defragmented if you like about losing your weight okay. you'll be more Focused. Ah, and uh, this is aimed towards ladies? This is aimed towards ladies. This is not aimed towards gentlemen. There's nothing here to do with men. Okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Molly, perhaps you could give us a little bit of a background, what you do. When I was about 42 or 43, I had an instant psychic opening. I wasn't particularly born psychic, and it wasn't the most comfortable experience and this is sort of about 25 years ago now, um, I knew that I was in for something, but I couldn't have told you what, because I used to do really odd things, like asking God, what am I supposed to be doing here? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I wasn't even religious. Yeah. Um, that went on, and I started to see lots of past life um, memories, because I was having lots of hypnotherapy at the time. And then after that, the psychic stuff speeded up, and I was be giving people readings, especially to do with their past lives, because I could see what was going on. Um, I developed as a trance medium, and I was able to exercise um, psychic surgery quite easily on people, very quickly. And then it gradually got more and more in depth, and I opened up a school, School of Psychic Studies, in 1997. That was quite phenomenal, because um, I put, I think, one tiny little advert in the paper, and um, it went all over London in the freebie, just was everywhere. And all these people were ringing me up and saying, you know, where is this school we want to study? And then the local press got hold of it. So it, it just went really fast. And um, the weight loss was just part of that. I okay. teach people psychic development and the weight loss is just part of it. Yeah. Um, I also train people to become healers, psychic healers, which is different from Reiki and other spiritual healing. A psychic healer is looking specifically for something. So if you were to say to me, um, my brother has a problem with sitting next to the girl in his classroom or whatever, that's just a, an example, I would immediately go into that specific problem and clear it so he didn't have a problem with her. Okay. And what a great foundation for psychic slimming. And thank you very much for joining us here today. Thank Molly you. Ann Fairley. Thank you.